Hallelujah to Jesus. We give God a praise. Let God be magnified in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. This is God's Son Channel with Evangel Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you. Please, family, like this video. Share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you as you do that in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. They are trying to find out something about someone. Because every battle that you are faced with, you keep winning. You keep winning. And because you keep overcoming the battle, you now have more boldness. Like you are always ready. If any battle is going to come, you are just like an army that is saying, bring it on. You know that kind of a thing. Bring it on. Bring it on. Bring it on. Now, because you now understand that every battle that you are faced, through God you have won. Somebody to that person, this is the message. They are trying to find out how you are doing all of that. Because they have seen it that how you have made the battle easy. Like you are having a swift victory. Like swiftly you will just sweep the whole victory. You are not leaving anything at all for your enemy to like say, okay, we won today, tomorrow, maybe she will win. No. You are just winning back to back. You are just winning back to back, always ready, equipped with the word of God, always ready. Yes, let the battle come, we are ready. <clears throat> let them come, we are ready. <clears throat> you know that kind of a mindset. Because the way you are defeating your enemies, it is something that is even surprising. That they want to know, how are you defeating them so easily? It's just like when Moses, when David confronted Goliath, David defeated the, the same Goliath that the whole world was hearing about. Everybody was so scared of him. All the armies were so scared when they hear about Goliath. They're like, oh. And that same Goliath, when, when that Goliath confronted David, David just killed Goliath like just a, a bed or a fowl. He did not even sweat. He didn't sweat. He did not sweat. He just killed Goliath. So easy. So every up down people, the armies that were behind Goliath, they were shocked. They started fleeing. How? How? How did he manage to kill Goliath? How? They want to find out. There is a God in heaven that equips his people. Yes. When you know your God, there is no battle that will come that will shake you. There is no battle that will come. You know, child of God, you defeated them. This is, that is why they are trying to find out how. How are you doing this? You know, your secret weapon is in God. If they cannot go and find God and open God and know how he's doing everything, they will not be able to find out. Because what they don't know, they cannot attack. They want to know so that they can attack it. They can't attack God. They can't kill God. There is no attack on God that can ever get to God. He is God. He is not a man. You defeated the Goliath. <coughs> every Goliath, every war that you have encountered since you accepted Jesus Christ, Every battle, every oppression, every attack, you just have victory swiftly. And many are confused. How are you doing this? <laughs> the Lord is my shepherd. The strength that I need to win the world, I will not want it. He has given it to me already. Hallelujah. The Bible said, The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When the wicked, when they come, and my enemy, when they come upon me to eat up my flesh, the Bible said they stumble and they fail. 
child of God, the Lord is your light and your salvation. That is your secret. And that is what they want to know. They cannot know how to attack it because it is God that gave it to you. You have defeated every battle that the enemy set against you. And I pray for you, you will keep defeating. You will keep taking victory over every battle. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remain your sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.